Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel. I am your online trainer Khalid Mahmood. In today's tutorial, we will create exercise 42 step by step in AutoCAD. This drawing contains multiple geometry shapes including chamfer, fillet, precise dimension. Whether you are a beginner or an intermediate AutoCAD user, this video will help you precise your essential command and improve your drafting skill. So stay tuned and let's get started. Step 1. Setting up the drawing. So open your AutoCAD and create a new drawing file. Set the unit to millimeter. Using unit command, just press UN enter and choose as a type decimal and precision will be 0 and session scale will be millimeter. Press OK. Now step 2. Creating the center line. As you see in this diagram, this one is a center line. As you see in this diagram and also this one as a center line. So this line from here to here as a 140 and this one from here to here 38. Start with the line command and draw a horizontal center line of 140 mm. L for line, click on first point, press F8 to activate ortho and put a value 140, 140 press enter. Now second, need to create a second line vertically 38. So L for line, click on this midpoint of this line and upside it will be 38. Press enter. Select both line, go to properties and check a line type as a center and color will be red. Now step 3. Drawing the main structure. So this one is our main structure. We are going to using O for offset command. O for offset and put a value as a offset 38. Press enter. Click from here to upside and also Again, O for offset and put a value as a 25, enter, right side and left side both. So just click here, right side and click here as a left side. Select these two line, go to properties and check as a by layer and line will be again by layer. Now create one more offset, this one just from here to here offset value 4 so use o for offset command and put a value as a offset 4 enter select this line and downside it will be 4 now we are going to create this chamfer so use c h a for chamfer command using d for dimension and put a value as a chamfer 4 enter again 4 enter Select this line to this line. As same as select this line to this line. Now trim this line using TR double enter. Trim this one and also this one. Now need to create the center part. So just offset from the center to right side as a 3 and also left side as a 3. So use O for offset command. Press as a offset value 3, press enter. Select this line as a right side. Again, select this line as a left side. Now need to match MA for match from this line to this line. Okay. Now need to zoom. Need to create this circle. So use C for circle from this center point and put the radius of the circle as a 5. Press enter. Select this circle. M for move. Downside it will be 16. Press enter. Now need to trim unwanted part of this drawing. So just using TR double enter. Trim this one, this one, this one and this one. Also this inner part. As same as upside trim this all this one. Okay. Just need to add these curves as a fillet. If you see here as a main drawing, 
here using DRA for dimension radius and put a check radius will be 3. So need to apply here as a radius 3. So use add one more line from the center line to upside it will be 12.5. So use O for offset command and put a value as a 12.5 press enter. Select this line and will be upside. Now using MA for match and match this line. Now need to trim this line and this line. Now from here to here add curves. So use F for fillet, R for radius and radius value will be 3 enter. Now use T for trim and put a value as a no trim. Click here to here as same as click here and this click here. Okay. Now need to trim this line. Okay. Just zoom out. So your first part complete. Now step 4. Creating the middle cutouts. As you see in this diagram, we need to create these middle cutouts. Okay. So now first we need to make this line. From here offset will be 25. So use OF for offset. Put a value 25. Press enter. Click here to be downside. Need to create a line. L for line, just this one and put a value as a 18, press enter. Select this line, use M for move, click here, hold control button and right click of your mouse and choose as a from and click this point and downside it will be 6, press enter. Now zoom out, now again activate line command. From here to upside it will be 12 press enter and left side it will be 10 enter and downside it will be 6 enter and this one from right side 3 enter and down will be as same as this line. We need to create this chamfer and chamfer value will be 6 so use C HA for chamfer command, D for dimension of the chamfer and put a value of chamfer will be 6 enter, again 6 enter. Click on this line to this line. Now TR double enter, trim this line to this line. Select all your part using MI for mirror command and click on this point to downside and press as a no enter now tr double enter trim this one and this one so your inner slot will be completed now step 5 adding the side features as you see in this diagram this one our side feature and also this one so we now we need to create these side features so just zoom out and from here choose l for line from here put a value as a line of and put a value of this line 16 enter select this line using M for move from here to here. Now again create one more line L for line and put a value of this line 25 enter. Now this line put from here distance will be 30 so select this line M for move click on this midpoint and hold a control right click from from here to it will be here 30 press enter now create one more offset from this line to this line it will be 5 so use o for offset yeah otherwise you can choose copy command co for copy select this line press enter and click right side as a 5 press enter now create these cuffs so using C for circle command press 2P for two point circle first this point to this point as same as 2P enter from here to here 
need to join this curves line so using l for line click here to here as same as click here to here now need to trim tr double enter trim this one to this one also this one and this one now one side slot will be completed now select these lines and circles and curves using mi for mirror and click this point to this point and choose as a node now using tr double enter trim this one this one this one and this one so step six add dimensions so i already explained how can you add dimension so before adding the dimension select all your sketch except these center line go to properties and add a line thickness as a 0 0.30 now add dimension using dli for dimension linear command from here to here as same as from here to here and also as same as from here and also from so just we make fast forward Ensure that text side is readable by adjusting dimension scale in the dimension style manager. Now step 7 saving and export your drawing. So using control S to so save your drawing and control P to print as a PDF as you want. So don't forget to download the practice drawing from the link in the description box and try it yourself. So did you find this tutorial helpful? Let us know in the comment. Did you find this tutorial helpful? Let us know in the comment box. Like this video and subscribe our YouTube channel for more AutoCAD tutorial. So turn on notifications so never miss any update. So join our YouTube channel to support us and get exclusive contents. So thank you. Thanks for your time. Tata. Bye bye. Take care.